This video is going to show you how to create a web page on Weebly. To sign up, type in your full name, your email address, and then come up with a password. Then click Get Started. First, you need to define the focus of your site. For this project, you're going to create a website, so click the button that says Site. Next, you want to select a theme. The theme is what your page will look like. You have a lot of options to choose from. I'm going to select this theme. Once you've found the theme that you want, click the orange button that says Choose. Before you begin editing your website, you need to give it a name. First, select to use a subdomain of Weebly.com. Next, type the name of your business into the box. If it's available, you will see this green check mark. If it's not, you will need to come up with a new name. Then click Continue. First, I'm going to type the name of the business. And then, I'm going to type a short description. We fix computers. Next, I'm going to change the button text. So I will highlight the text and delete it. Then I'm going to change it to about. And I'm going to have the button link to the About page. To do that, click on Link, then Standard Page, and then the About page. Click Save. Click anywhere on the screen to get rid of this box. Now I'm going to edit the image. I'm going to click on Edit Image, then Add Image. I'm going to search for an image. And since this is a computer repair business, I'm going to look for an image of a computer. Before I select a picture, I want to make sure I'm using free photos. And you'll see there are lots of pictures to choose from. And you can hit Next to see more images. I'm going to select this image. So what I need to do is click the blue button that says select. Now you can move the image. And once you're done, hit OK. Every time you edit an image, you need to go to the top right corner and hit Save. When you click on Save, you're given three options. 
you can save the image to all of the pages, to this page only, or save it to selected pages. I'm going to save it to all pages. Now I'm going to go over to the About page. Again, I'm going to edit the image. And I have to hit Save again. And I'm only going to save it to this page. Now I'm going to add a title. I will drag it and drop it. And I'm going to call the title About Idea Computer Repair. Next, I'm going to drag and drop text. And here is where I'm going to type a paragraph giving the history and information about my business. If you want to add images, you can drag those over and again drop them in place. If you want to remove anything on the page, just hover over the box and you will see an X. If you click on the X, you're asked if you want to delete the item and just click delete. In order to make your contact page, drag contact form into the space below. This is where potential customers will write you messages. And again, you can go in and edit your image. And save it just like you did on the other pages. Now, once you're done building your website, to save it, you want to hit publish. After you hit Publish, click Continue. And then click on the link that they give you in blue. This is what your web page looks like for other people. If you want to go back to Edit, just click on the Other tab Close that window by clicking on the X, and you can continue to edit your web page. Just don't forget to hit publish once you're done.